Here we go. What's up, Monday Geeks? Mr. V here. Welcome to another video, guys. So in this one, I want us to talk about Arriver. Um, for those of you guys that has been following my channel, you know that I'm actually really bullish on the stock. I like the company um, ever since uh, they, they came to the scene. Even before they announced they were going to go public, I mentioned it here on the channel. did a video. I actually spoke to the president um, here on the channel, the video, so that you can go watch them. So um, they're still making some stripes, and I want to cover some new development that the company just put out there so that uh, for those of you that are in the stock, you can see that there's potential here uh, for long-term investment. But before we get started, guys, if you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. So guys, Arriver is a London-based EV manufacturer, so they specialize in um, electric vans as well as city buses. Uh, but most recently, they're, they're adding to their portfolio of products. So let's kind of jump right here to the news so I can show you guys. So um, Arriver partnered with Uber to design an EV uh, for rideshare drivers. So remember back when Uber was actually doing their own test for self-driving cars, um, they finally scrapped that project. And now they've actually found a partner that can help them bring that to, to light. So if you can see more news here, Arriver, UK's Arriver, um, Uber to develop electric ride hailing Arriver car. So this is excellent news to me. Um, not only are they building their vans, which are the vans and their and their uh, city buses are actually scheduled to uh, start production, uh, I think, third quarter of 2022. And then now their uh, arrival car talking with uh, no, partnering with Uber here, they think about starting production the fourth quarter of 2023. So that's about a year after they start their vans and their city buses. So. I like the news here. Again, Arriver, um, the stock, as like most EV stocks, is really not doing very well right now. But for me, this is not a quick win. This is a long-term investment. Uh, I've actually seen a lot of the stuff that the company did. Like I said, as we had an interview here with their uh, president, and they have a business model. They have the technology. Um, they have their manufacturing approach is different from most other manufacturing approach. They do what we call micro factories. So they don't build like the big massive gigafactory like Tesla has. They build smaller factories. Um, they don't, they're not going to have assembly lines, which makes their production a lot more efficient because they're just bringing components um, and putting them together. They call it component based manufacturing. So it's a different approach. And I think based on talking to their president, this is going to save them a lot of time, get their product to market, and they can actually establish closer to their customers. So that's why I like the stock. So let's kind of take a look at here, what the stock has been doing lately. So you can see here, as I'm doing this video, it's kind of trading about $18. Um, again, if we just go back here a month, the stock has not done so hot lately. This is just one month chart here. You can see we had a low here about 13. It kind of squeezed up um, back in April to like uh, 19 and some change. If we go back six months, um, you can see that the high of this stock has been about $36. Uh, and that was back in December of 2020. And so since then, it's just been pulling back again. We're going through this phase where all electric vehicle stocks, majority of them are really uh, consolidating. So um, again, I'm buying more of a river as I see the opportunity because um, I think this is one of the long-term plays that I have. There's a, that we have a lot of players in the space. You just have to be very careful um, how you choose them. Um, I know I have Tesla, I have Neo, I have Arriver. So again, I'm looking at the players. I'm not going to buy every single one. I'm looking at the ones that fit my strategy, that fit what I'm looking for. Again, when you go into the space, make sure that you know exactly uh, what you're looking for because there's going to be a lot of pretenders in the space. You know, you have the Nicolars and all these other companies. There's going to be a lot of pretenders. At the end of the day, only a few are going to survive. So um, I think Arriver is going to be one of them. Uh, I like the, the design of the vans. I like their city buses. Um, there are other companies that are competing in this space, but I think in the UK, Arriver would be the number one uh, electric vehicle manufacturer, which to me, it's the pride of the country. So they're going to support uh, a, a company like this 
uh, to make sure that they, so they survive and establish themselves as the leader in that space in the country. So that's what I wanted to cover in this video. Um, just a quick recap here. Um, Arriver as a company started out talking about manufacturing, uh, delivery vans, as well as city buses, changing how we use um, vans and city buses from a fossil fuel perspective to electric vehicle. Now they've added the Arriver car. And in this case, they are partnering with Uber. We know Uber as a very um, strong company, established company. They tried their hand at manufacturing electric or let's say autonomous vehicles, and that didn't work out so good. So I think it makes sense for them to partner with a company like Arriver. Um, again, Arriver has partnerships with UPS to, to produce about a thousand vans, delivery vans for them. They are actually building factories in South Carolina and North Carolina. So this company is just gearing up um, again to get their production rolling out uh, in the third quarter of 2022. So I'm still super excited about this one. Um, again, buying the dips as I see. Um, I know the market is very really choppy right now. So if we go back here, um, just five days, I, I look for these opportunities. I, I'm waiting. This thing is still going to pull back maybe around uh, $13, $14 um, just because the market is so choppy right now. And when it gets to that point, I'll pick up some more shares and continue to add to my position because um, I believe in the company long term so let me know again in the, co in the in the comment section what you think about this do you currently own a river if not what's your take on the company just do some research again do your due diligence before you jump into stocks like this if you're new to the channel we talk about how to earn money how to save money how to invest and build wealth so if that's something that interests you go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content also if you are looking to get started with investing guys Weibo has their promotion where if you sign up and deposit $100, you get some free stocks to get you started. Links in the description below. And as always, do your due diligence. Don't be a greedy savage and stay motivated.